Hey, how's it going? I'm building some condensers now, and I thought I'd show you this little thing I do uh, to eliminate using cardboard. Typically, when you're building a piece of glassware that's jacketed, you want to um, use cardboard to hold the center tube in one place on one side, and then work one side, hand anneal it, flip it over, and then pull this down and, and work this side. I've devised a, a way to do this without using any cardboard at all, so I thought I'd just what show I'm you beforehand is uh, taping this down to my center tube and um, did the jacket here so it fits over it. The catch is, is this is almost, this tube on center piece is supposed to be 300 millimeters from the ring seal to ring seal and what I did was, this is on the long side, on this side, I flared up slightly and I put a little hole on this side. So when I come down and tack onto this, I'll still have low to the center too. I'm going to show you. So see here's where I'm going to do my seal. And right here, look inside here. Let's see if I can get this to come up here. See the little hole there? I got a hole next to the flange. Okay. So the first thing I do, timing is a, is a, is a bit of an issue here. So what I do is I preheat this lip because I want this to get soft before the other part. So I get this color on it. Come over here, get about where I want it, right about there. Preheat this up and I'm just going to mash it down real quick. Make sure you make it seal. So I can seal all the way around. Well it's still hot. Come over here, this is not moved at all. I'm supposed to do a ring seal under this. So now there's a ring seal on this side, there's still a hole right there. Is that hard enough? Now I work this in. Go ahead and put my side arm on. Thank you. 